to another send-off, a dependable and wise politician whose words were always measured. Those were the words President Uhuru Kenyatta used to describe the late Garissa Senator Yusuf Haji. He was laid to rest hours after his death at the Langata Cemetery. Many who interacted with him when he was alive have also described him as a father figure and a stickler to law. NTV's Kennedy Moravi with the details. President Uhuru Kenyatta led family and hundreds of Kenyans for the final rites of the late Garissa Senator Yusuf Haji at the Langata Muslim Cemetery. The president said the country had lost a true leader whose wisdom was relied on a lot. Taifa la Kenya, limepoteza kiongozi shuja, kiongozi ambaya mesimamia haki, za wanainchi wa taifa hii letu la Kenya, kiongozi ambaya mefanya kazi ya wanainchi. The president who put him in charge of the Building Bridges Initiative notes that Haji was depended on by key associates of not just the Kenyan government but also of regional governments. Mzee Haji, mashauri yake, haikuwa ya kitu chochote. Ni mashauri ya kutoka kwa roho, ya kutoka fikira zake, na ndipo nilikuwa na muamini vila nilimuamini. At his home earlier in the day, Family and friends streamed in to comfort the bereaved family. National Treasury Cabinet Secretary Okori Atani led a host of cabinet secretaries at the late Haji's home. As senators who served with him said they had lost a true icon. If there is one man from all the parameters of having all the necessary quality of goodness, is none other than Yusuf Haji. He always stands what is right. He was not wobbling around. Politically, neither would he wobble uh, on issues which are not right. And for me, he was a father figure. So I reached out to him. He was my confidant. And I will miss not just um, an example. I will miss a father figure. Senator Yusuf Haji was uh, the icon in the Senate. Is the, he was the voice of wisdom. Those President called on the country to relook at the BBI document the senator championed keenly with the aim of passing it in his honor. Yusuf Haji had issues and he didn't say them, but remained very firm on the course of Building Bridges Initiative. In fact, I wish in his, in his honor, in his memory, Kenyans will sit back and uh, tone down the rhetoric that is there now on BBI. Mzee Haji has been eulogized differently by those who knew him as the family now announces three days of mourning to remember the fallen hero. There will be different sites of mourning. We will have a site in Mombasa, a site in Malindi, a site in Gariza and a site in Nairobi. Yeah, so we will be, those of you who can, and a site in Masalan, Ijara, his home area. Senator Haji had just been flown in back into the country on Saturday and admitted at Aga Khan Hospital where he succumbed Monday morning. Kennedy Muredi. And TV.